Hey, Scorpio, Scorpio, I don't know why, but look at the five of swords in reverse. I don't know what it is, but for some reason, when I was meditating on your energy, I kept, Leo kept popping up in my head. I don't know. Maybe some of y'all got have a relationship with a Leo or, I don't know. Kept hearing Leo, 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 Leo. So we're going to see what's going on with you, Spirit, Father God. Lord have mercy. <laughs> what's going on with our beautiful Scorpios, our water energy, Spirit? What's going on with our beautiful Scorpios here, Spirit? What we got here? Okay, we got the two of coins here in reverse, so it's a lot of mess and the five of wands conflict. Damn. Damn. This is how we're going to start out? Two of wands, two of coins in reverse, and the five of wands here. So there's completely some arguments. Something about some argument, conflict about some big mess. The queen of cups here in reverse. This is cancer energy. Someone here who's very jealous. Someone here who's very uh, abusive, clingy, possibly. Or could this be, some of you guys may be a cancer moon. Maybe you just don't, you are on... Um, What's the word I'm trying to say? Maybe you're being hostile to these people, but I feel like you got a reason why. What's this two of coins here? And it could be some arguments here dealing with money here too as well. What's this two of coins here in reverse? And on um, the five of wands here, Spirit, for our beautiful Scorpios. What, what, what is this about, Spirit? Please be clear. The two of coins here in reverse here and this five of wands here. Be clear here for Scorpio. What is this about here, Spirit? Okay, here the Queen of Cups. So the Queen of Cups is causing all this shit. The Four of Swords here in reverse. Let me see. Tell me more about this Queen of Cups here. What's going on with this Queen of Cups here in reverse? This hateful ass person. This is hateful ass energy. What's this Queen of Cups here in reverse here? For Scorpio. Look at this. What is this spirit? Okay, here the Ace of Swords. So you done found out some truth and some clarity about some shit. Woo! Tell me more about this um Ace of Swords here, spirit. Cutting out the bullshit. Maybe this is you, Scorpio. Like I said, what's this Ace of Swords here and this Queen of Cups here in reverse? Cutting all this mess out. What is this? The two of cups here. You found some truth about a relationship. Some of y'all, this could be a same-sex um, relationship. The six of swords here. Somebody can't get past something here. It's too hot, too heated. It could be third-party situation. A lot of gossiping going on, but you don't found out some shit. You don't found out some truths about some, some relationship here. I feel like you're letting somebody have it. You're giving somebody the business. I feel like whatever this may be is so hurtful that it's like hard to get past it. Like this energy just keep coming up. What's this Ace of Swords here, Spirit, and this Two of um, Cups here? Possibly dealing with the Pisces. This is Ace of Swords here and this Two of Cups here, Spirit, for uh, Scorpio. Yep, the Six of Swords here. This could be an energy of somebody being stuck in the past here too as well. But something is not moving forward here. The Knight of Coins here. So who is here being stubborn? The Seven of Wands here and guarded. The Tower here in reverse. Tell me more about this Six of Swords here in reverse here, Spirit. Maybe you're coming to a realization on why this relationship is not moving. Why it's not moving forward. What is this on oh, Six of Swords here in reverse here, Spirit for Scorpio? The Knight of Coins here. Somebody want to do some shit their way. Why, why, why is this energy so slow though, Spirit? There'll be an argument about money too. But why is this energy so slow? This Knight of Coins here. Y'all, I can't even do this. This Knight of Coins here and this Seven of Swords here in reverse. 
possibly dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, but I'm getting Taurus energy. Maybe Leo came out because Leo, the strength card in the tarot is Leo. Maybe you just need strength. And stay in your ground on something. What is Knight of Coins here, Spirit, and the Six of Swords here? See, I don't like this. The Knight of Wands want to come out. This is called the Knight of Wands, but it just looked like a sword to me. So somebody here is quickly taking action onto something. You know, Knights, they don't really commit. They're like in and out energy. Here you are, the Queen. Tell me more about um the Six of Swords here in reverse here and this Knight of Coins here. What is this? Oh my God. This Six of Swords here in reverse here and this Knight of Coins here, Spirit. What is this? The Six of Swords here in reverse here and this Knight of Coins here, Spirit, or um, Scorpio. What is this? Damn, the five of coins here, yeah. I feel like this has a lot to do with money here too as well. Somebody's in grief and in, and in despair. Somebody was left out in the cold. Or maybe you're just not dealing with this energy anymore. Yeah, the ten of coins here with birds. There's some type of debt here. A family dispute or separation. Some type of debt here. Ten of coins here with birds. Yeah, the ten of swords. Betrayal. Something here you're going to find out about. The Temperance car here in reverse. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Let's, let's continue. What's this five of coins here, Spirit? Why is the five of coins here? And you've been loyal in this relationship? Why is this five of coins here, spirit? Let me have to put, yep. You see what I'm saying here? The 10 of coins here. This is a big, major loss. Big, huge, major loss. You've been loyal to something here and you did not get what you deserved in return. And something here is not moving forward. And you put forth the time and the effort. You're being considerate. I feel that's what I'm, the hermit, and you're thinking all about this shit. You're thinking it all through, yeah. Like, you don't want to be stressed. You can't even really communicate with this person. The two of swords here. Yeah, there's a decision here that needs to be made, and you need to set boundaries. Because whatever this is, it's not balanced. The queen of wands here, the fool card here. Let me see his spirit. What else you want to tell um, Scorpio? I don't know why I'm having trouble on um, shuffling the deck. What is this? The Eight of Cups here. So this is sideways. The Eight of Cups. Yeah, you're not happy. And so I feel like somebody here is really arrogant. You're not happy with this individual. You're not happy with this energy. Tell us more here, Spirit. What else you want Scorpio to know? Okay, here the four of wands here. The six of cups here. Somebody from the past is coming back. Now, I don't know if this is dealing with your person. It's so why all this stuff is coming in. Because like I said, the five of ones is also too about conflict too, but it's about competition. And a lot of times it's about third party situations here too as well. Then you have the two of pentacles in reverse, which means it's nothing but a bunch of mess, a total chaos. Like it's like a collapse in something here. Meanwhile, while you have been trying to put things together and be loyal, this energy doesn't even appreciate that. Okay. So some, something coming back around. What is this? The Seven of Cups said, yeah, somebody here had you um, as an option. Tell me more about the Seven of Cups. Sales. Trying to sell you an illusion. Somebody trying to cloud your judgment. Tell me more about the Seven of Cups here, Spirit. The High 
priestess here. You possibly um you possibly is a tarot is a tarot reader getting tarot read to get some type of insight. Somebody trying to see something here to get some type of insight on what's going on here. What's the bottom? Yeah, the two of swords here. A decision needs to be made. Or something here became clear to you. What's the seven of cups here in this high priestess? And a high priestess is someone who is uh, patient here too as well. What's the seven of cups here, spirit? And a high priestess here, spirit. For Scorpio. Yep, the two of swords want to come out. In reverse, clarify this two of swords here. In reverse, your spirit for Scorpio. What is this? The four of swords here. So you're definitely taking a break. The star card here. You're trying to heal and move on. You're trying to heal and move on. The world card here, reverse here, and the page of swords here. I I feel like in the <laughs> the eight of coins here. So okay, so you're 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 healing, trying to move on from whatever this may be. But then you have the world card here and the page of swords here in reverse. Okay, so this is like some unfinished business going on here. Somebody here possibly want to work on. You, you listen. You're not trying to complete this. You're not trying to solve this puzzle. I don't know. This is what I'm hearing. Then here you have here the eight of coins here. And someone here speaking ill will against you, especially with the page of swords here in reverse. This will never be a success is what I'm hearing. And the two of swords and the four of swords, once again, is the energy of the six of swords. Tell me more about this two of swords here in reverse here and this four of swords here. And I'm getting the energy of why you're healing and moving on. I feel like you're not going to want to be answering any questions, whatever this may be. Um, they can feel incomplete. Oh, I'm hearing the energy like somebody need the whole tea. Like somebody don't have the whole tea. Somebody want all the information. I don't know. I'm also getting the energy too with that page of swords in reverse. You need to be careful of fraudulent activity. Okay. So what's this two of swords in reverse here and this four of swords here? Yep, the Ten of Swords here, Betrayal. The ultimate betrayal. We're wanting to come out here, the Three of Cups here sideways. Tell me more about the two of, the Ten of Swords here. For them betraying you, is done. Tell me about the Ten of Swords here, Spirit. Yep, the strength card here. What didn't break you only made you stronger. Leo showed up right here, the five of swords. But of course, it's going to be all type of conflict. Of course it is. The five of swords here, the ace of wands here, reverse. The eight of wands here. Oh, yeah. The six of wands here, reverse. Tell me more about this five of pentacles here. And this ten of pentacles here, reverse. Five of Pentacles here and this Ten of Pentacles here in reverse. I'm hearing losing half or losing it all. What is this? The Knight of Wands here. So somebody here is taking action or coming in quickly, trying to take action on something. Tell me about this Five of Pentacles here and this Ten of Pentacles. Um, Ten of Pentacles here in reverse. Damn. Y'all, I don't know what is going on. This Five of Pentacles here and this Ten of Pentacles here in reverse. The 
could have been dealing with somebody who, who can't keep a job either. The seven of swords here. The seven of coins in reverse. What is this deception about spirit? What is this deception about? There's something going on in the family. So, okay, you got a family member. There's something here going on with family. For some of y'all, that y'all family is keeping y'all out of something here. Five of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles here in reverse, and the Seven of Swords. So it's something here that for some of you, like I said, not for all, um, your family, they're keeping you out of something here. It could be something old to you. The Page of Swords here once again and the Emperor. And somebody's not giving you communication about it. It could be about a deceased fe um, family member, a father. Okay, the Eight of Cups walking away. The Nine of Wands, yeah. That's just for some of you. What's this deception here, Spirit? What's this Seven of Swords here? Be clear, Spirit. What is this deception about? Eight of Cups walking away. Hold on. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups and this Seven of Swords. Is somebody trying to leave you hanging with something and not being honest? Somebody not being honest about their pockets? Let me see. What's this Eight of Cups here and this um, Seven of Swords here, Spirit? What is this about? The Lovers. It's about a relationship. Gemini Energy. Tell us more about this Eight of Cups here. Somebody dealing with somebody else. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups here. And on the lovers. The Eight of Cups and Lovers spirit. The Magician. Manipulation. Okay, that's what, that's it. Somebody trying to trick you. This energy trying to trick you. Tell me more about this magician here in reverse. Eight of Cups walking towards you. Some, I'm telling somebody wants you to feel also too. They trying to trick you. Um, possibly though. Now the lovers card could be that they mess them, that they teamed up with you. You got two energies here. The lovers and here the two of cups here. Okay. So they could be balancing in between both people. Okay. Playing with your damn emotion. But somebody's pockets ain't the way they are. This person is not stable at all. The magician card here in reverse. The magician in reverse is also to the energy of a person who don't hold any type of power. Or like they need to, this could be an energy vampire. Who knows? It could be just that. You got the magician here and the high priestess here. So you possibly got somebody here who could be doing dark magic here too as well. But I'm also feeling like somebody's trying to trick you into this. You see what I'm saying? The eight of swords here, trying to restrict you, trying to hold you back. The three of cups here. Somebody trying to, so that you don't see that they are dealing possibly with a third party situation. Okay, and then here you got the King of Wands here with the Knight of Swords here in reverse. Oh my goodness. Look, the Eight of Swords here, the Three of Cups here, the King of Wands here, and the Knight of Swords here in reverse. Okay, this person has have malicious intent towards you. Here we have the Hair Fun here and the Tile card here. Taurus Energy. You find out some knowledge about something. So this could possibly be a marriage. The Three of Pentacles here in reverse. So there's definitely some type of separation that is going on. The Hermit card here in reverse. Okay? But it says here that you're going to receive some type of help. Maybe you're giving or somebody is helping this happen. Or somebody is helping this happen. Are you having conflicts with like a mother-in-law? Or somebody's mother is all in y'all business. 
If somebody's not putting forth the effort to even change this, the five of swords, and that's what the conflict is about. This could be a child, okay, or somebody who just act real childish that is, that is controlling. They're jealous of you because you are the nine of pentacles here, like you got it going on. The king of cups here in reverse, but this person don't communicate with you well. Whoever you're in a relationship with, they don't communicate with you well. Neither are they trying to. And this could also be an energy of block communication. Once again, here we got the three of wands here and the world card here. So this is this is not going to be full circle. This is not going anywhere. Let's see. Spirit, what you want to tell um, our beautiful Scorpios? Y'all know why I'm having such trouble. Leap of faith. It is safe to make the move you're considering. Because you got to get out of this. Give me another card in here, Spirit. For Scorpio. I still want to say Leo for some reason. I don't know why Leo keeps popping in my mind. Are you a Leo moon or I don't know. Give me another card here, Spirit, for Scorpio. And a lot of y'all, y'all had got some type of communication during the Sagittarius full moon here too as well. If it's not that full moon, it's going to be a next one. And time apart some distance will help bring clarity another card here spirit Play okay find time to laugh goof off and enjoy each other Maybe you and this person need to reconnect. I don't know. Take it. Take this car how it resonates. Okay. Give another car here, spirit. Could be just an energy of maybe this eight of wands could be like whoever this is, whatever type of relationship this is, it could be an uh, energy of just like dodging the elephant in the room. Like, let's sit down and let's see. Because I didn't see new love on here. All I'm seeing is separation and everything else. Maybe it's a time to like, let's just be real on what's going on in this relationship. And then maybe with that person or with you, Scorpio, when it's a relaxed mood, things come out. When a person is feeling more relaxed to say what's on their mind. I still feel like with this Queen of Cups here, I feel like this is somebody mama because the Queen of Cups is, can be a cold-hearted person or you cold towards this individual because all the shit that they take, they, they take, took you through. Give Children are important to this partnership. Could be the pages. Pages did show up. Give me another card here, Spirit. Put away the computer working list will help strengthen your relationship. Acceptance. Everything happens for a reason. All right, Scorpio, that is your reading. See you next time. Bye.